guys and welcome back to Unjaded Jade. Welcome to my 5am morning routine. So my alarm is placed on the opposite side of my room and also gets louder by the second meaning I'm really keen to turn it off as soon as I wake up. First things first I just go to the toilet which is really exciting I know. Um, I then go and I start making my bed. This is actually something I could never be bothered to do until I started waking up at 5am. I then crawl onto my yoga mat and do about half an hour of yoga. This is probably the most crucial half an hour of the entire day and completely sets up how the day will be. So while I'm doing my yoga, I like to mentally set intentions for the day. I like to remind myself what I'm grateful for, um, tell myself things like I am beautiful and worthy of happiness and success and basically set up my mind way more positively and also check in with how I'm feeling in general and sort of respect however I am feeling. I'm ready to start my day. I then open the broken curtains and look outside and if the sky is beautiful I will sit and I will marvel at it. Now I don't do this every day, just when I feel like it or remember and I just write, um, and I write anything. Sometimes it's more like diary style, sometimes it's like a train of thought, or sometimes it's poetic. Just anything. It kind of gets my brain working and it gives me some clarity in the morning. Here I was just writing about the day before in kind of reflective, positive light. And then comes the flexible personal time. So in exam season, this is unfortunately revision, but I also focus on personal projects like editing YouTube videos. Then I'll roughly form a to-do list or some kind of daily outline or outstanding work that I need to do just to keep on top of it in the day, especially at sick form. <laughs> Some days I feel like, yes, ready to go, 5am, good day ahead, and other days I'm like, bed. <laughs> Mind over mattress. <laughs> Then I go downstairs and straight away make porridge. I used to literally hate porridge as a child and yet now I have it every day. It only takes like 10 minutes. Um, I just use gluten-free oats, hazelnut milk as my favorite milk, and then chopped banana. I like my porridge pretty thick. Um, so yeah, I fill it with like lots of toppings and then I'll add some fruit of some kind, whether it's frozen in the winter, or taking advantage of the fresh fruit in the summer. And I'm not just making it look pretty for the video, like this is just what it looks like every day. I also always make breakfast for my mum nowadays, which is cute. <laughs> So I will always make a herbal tea to accompany me and then while I'm eating porridge I either do flashcards in exam season or I go on my phone and catch up and notice this is the first time I've gone on my phone all morning. It is so important to detach from social media in general. Also cheeky advertising, follow my Instagram jade.bowler. <laughs> then it's upstairs and shower time. And unfortunately, I am always last in my family to get the shower, so that's great. That morning, I just washed my hair, which is a pain. When I get back in my room, I will put on some good music and put on face cream and aloe vera all over my body. I'm quite prone to dry skin as well. Then, on to hair. Curly hair is kind of a struggle. Um, and mine, like, desperately needs a cut right now. 
So normally I just kind of scrunch in some oils to get some more moisture. My hair also looks quite frizzy and awful when it's damp, but it does settle down when it's dry. Then I'll just use deodorant and body spray. And I don't wear makeup to school, so I'll just brush out my eyebrows and then brush my teeth. And yes, I do have a mini sink in my room. <laughs> then I will put on a necklace, which tends to be my favorite moon necklace, as you probably know. And then I will get changed. We have a kind of smart dress code at sixth form, but it's not like suits or anything. Then I will pack my lunchbox for school, just whatever cool vegan things we happen to have, to be honest. Um, and then I'll put on my coat. And I do have a lot of badges, as you can probably see. And then I'll just chill until we leave for school at around eight-ish. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this. Here's my beautiful dog Willow with some mandatory cuddles. Please give this video a like if you'd like to see a night routine and subscribe to join our awesome little unjaded family. <laughs> watch this, watch this one. High five. Good girl.